but Buffalo does get a point. Libro goes on. They also got to cope with this serve. That's a great pickup. Oh, and that's a monster block. No. To know they can't go toe to toe with some of these giants of the sport in every way. Nice pick up. And that is what Volkov does best. Fizzing pipe. And the block, you can have as many hands as you like in there. They've all got blown away. But it was out, so Moscow will continue to serve. Ball on a spin. This has got to go over now from Volkov. Wow, great defense. And then Botolo tumbling over. Not the greatest and firmest of blocks from Kopsart. Even more so, it's an ace, Botolo. Worthy of a second viewing. Slovenia, Serbia and France gunning for that fourth place hey. and it's another race from Botolo. There are going to be some changes. Some will have seen enough. See if he can drive Russia back again. He's gone for the float which is just picked up by Kriuka. And Volkov will scramble a point. Crack that hard with Russia, the defending champions, level with Italy, at one set all. And there's an ace hey. to start Italy off. 101 kilometers an hour, a swerving serve against a very good service receiver in Kliuka, but didn't get that right. That's a good reception by Lecini. Can't say that for a long time. They were queuing up on the Russian side of the net. Let's just see that again. The block landed out. And Italy back out in front like it's the most obvious and natural thing in this match for so playing the Olympic champions Brazil in there another great pickup from Balasso that was heavy from Rechine and that's simply done by Volkov Balasso. Starting a bit of applause to lift their teammates. That tells you their spirits are rising as well. Pankov, good reach. He's up again, so is Kukayev. Great read by Golubev. Below and behind the block, and they take the point. That's 17-12. Changes. And Karkev returns before Golubev, ready to weave some magic at Libero. And this has got to go over. Another smart piece of footwork. Pinali lands it, but Golubev does his job. And Poltev cross-court lands it. He had the full hat-trick. Never had the chance because Poltev cross-court. Bang on the line. Six points to make up. A lot of set two when Russia went completely off the boil. 
And they're a bit more on the road now. Went off down a country lane in set two, but they're back on the motorway now in set four. Fiuka reacting quickly, and here's Boltev. Great pick up by Pinali. And that's a great finish, Bortolo. Found a hole. Two blockers, and he went through the seam. That's why it was so simple at the end. Nice. Calm and precise. And you could almost say that for the Russian team now. They look completely flustered. That's more like it. But Pankov also sidelined as well. Luchini's serve reception. Where Spiritu wanted it. And look how the course he collected the ball as well. Karkeyev and Frankov. Seen it regularly through the VNL. Could do with another one. That's good and strong. Volkov keeps it in play. And then such a quick movement with the arm. Back so fast and through even quicker. Interesting with Polteev to serve. So the Libero is on for the middle blocker. Going deep. And the middle blockers got that all wrong. Pankov takes a bit of a tumble. Wider was concerned it came down. And that's when... Things might change if Botolo and company can force a point and get them level. Poltev doesn't get the point just yet. Up goes the block and through the block from Kabuto. Get three points for 3 0 and 3 1, and only two for 3 2. And at the moment, Italy are looking good to take this to a fifth set. They're back on it again. They've found the momentum. And look at that, they're just collecting points. Eight points in a row for Italy. That's an ace. It's an ace. Although it's going to be disputed, there's going to be a challenge by Russia. Millimeters in. <laughs> He's relied on his teammates most of the time. That's a great pick up, Botolo. Really good. And that is a wonderful finish. Ha. This is his first senior tournament. This is just what you want. It's taking a lot out of Russia. And remember, they played Brazil in their final match on match day 15. That's got to stay up. Penale did his best. It wasn't the greatest pass, but it was still in play. Volkov down the line. Made it count. But Cavuto and Spiritu couldn't move quickly enough. Vormic to serve. That's not the tidiest of passes from Cavuto, because the, but the block is there and, and it's come off the block as well. It's that man Bottolo once more. Golubev is on and Volvic almost needed a wheelchair to come off the court. Walks so slowly, can't believe what's happening. 5-3 Volkov still on court. It's side out Italy. And here's Cavuto. Still it won't stick from Volvic. And the pipe eventually does the job. So ready as Libro to receive. That's a great pick up by Cavuto. Wow. From the front court. 
The boys in blue just stood there and Bottolo took advantage. Here's Mattia Bottolo. Good serve. Not the best from Golobev and he's only just keeping it in play. Russia doing well to recycle. Here comes Cavuto with the touch. And that's not the best because that is a point. Volkov to serve. That's an ace. What a time to produce it. And has Volkov, who struggled throughout this match, even though he's the top scorer, has he? And Spiritu to serve to keep Italy in this match. No longer a simple float, a service reception, a set. And there was Kirkiev to crash it over the line and Russia have done it. They are over the line by 15 points to 12, three sets to two. It is a win, but they only take two points, but it is at least a win. But boy, did they make that serve that difficult for themselves. They should have wrapped up this match surely in three sets, but they allowed Italy in not once, but twice.